Hi, my name is Marissa and I'm a content creator, front-end web developer, and UI designer. Usually I make how-to tutorials on UI design and coding, but in this video I thought I would do something a little bit different. In this video, I'm going to show you how to start your own creative side hustle, making money doing what you love. Share your app or website design by taking at ExcelPixel and at Adobe Student on Instagram. I get so many emails and questions from you guys on how to become a web designer slash developer in addition to how to start your own side hustle or creative business. Here's the truth, it's easier than you think. It's now easier than ever before to start your own creative side hustle, especially one that's online. I've always been passionate about design and creating content online. If you've ever watched my video on how I became a web designer, you know that my love for design goes way back. Fast forward to my second year in university, I came up with the idea to start my own YouTube channel and blog called Excel Pixel, where I make tutorials on web design, you know, web development and technology. Excel Pixel was my first legit side hustle because I worked on it while I was in university, when I was interning, and also during my nine to five. Since starting my side hustle Excel Pixel, I've been able to collaborate with some amazing brands and also build an audience of like-minded creatives like you. Thanks to sites like YouTube, you can start your own YouTube channel. With WordPress, you can start your own blog or website. And now that we're all on our mobile devices, many people have app ideas. Here's what you can do to start your creative side hustle. One of my favorite apps and one that I totally recommend for you to use is Adobe XD, where you can design and prototype that website or app idea that's been on your mind for so long. It's also 100% free for you to download. Most recently, I redesigned my blog with the help of Adobe XD and it made the coding process so much easier because I knew where I wanted everything to go and flow throughout my website. This year, I also designed a custom website for a client with Adobe XD. I also use XD to design graphics for my social media because it's such a lightweight program to use. You can use Adobe XD to create the next Instagram, or maybe you have an app idea that's gonna change the world. Whatever it is, use Adobe XD to start it and then turn it into an interactive prototype without ever touching a line of code. You just need to get started. That's all it takes. It's just that first step. Now, before you get worried about having to learn a whole new complicated app, I'm gonna show you just how easy it is to use Adobe XD. As you can see, when you first start Adobe XD, there are various artboard sizes to choose from, depending on what you want to create. You can create an app for an iPhone or Android phone. If you have a simple blog idea, maybe a fashion blog or a tech-related blog, you can choose from web-based artboards. Another cool feature in Adobe XD is its prototype mode. For one of my app design tutorials, I created this messaging app. And by selecting different objects on my artboard, I'm able to wire up interactions between the different artboards to create this completely interactive prototype. You can even download the Adobe XD app and show it to your friends, family, or if you really plan on making it big, you can even pitch your app idea to investors. Hey, dream big. Everyone has an app or website idea. What's yours? I wanna see what you create. Better yet, I challenge you to design your website or app idea in Adobe XD in seven days or less. Don't think too much about it or else you're gonna start doubting yourself and you probably won't even start it. It doesn't have to be perfect, just start it. I hope you found this video helpful and encouraging for you to start your creative side hustle. One day, that side hustle of yours can even turn into your full-time job that's making you money. All it takes is that first step to get started. I can't wait to see what you create, and I'll see you in the next video.